Imagine going back to November 2021 at the peak of the bull market and being able to buy top crypto projects like Avalanche, Polkadot, and Solana at a 90% discount. Would you have bought them? The issue that many retail investors face is that they follow the overall sentiment. Sentiment during that time was euphoric and at all time highs. Everyone thought that everything would continue going up forever. Then reality hit. When prices fall 70, 80, 90%, sentiment drops with it and nobody wants to buy. Essentially, you're buying at the top and selling at the bottom. So you're literally doing it backwards. Today, we're gonna look at some of the top crypto projects that are literally down over 70%, 80%, and even 90% from all-time highs. These projects are pretty much a guarantee to return to previous all-time highs if history repeats itself yet again. What's up, guys? I'm Jay and welcome to Bitcoin Daily. Remember that this content is for educational purposes only and is not financial advice. Always do your own research before risking any of your own money. And as a disclaimer, I am invested in Bitcoin since 2016. So if you're new here, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and smash that like button. Let's dive into today's video. All right, so let's start with the projects that are down 70% from all time highs. And then we will work our way to the projects that are down 80% and 90%. So the first project that barely missed the 70% mark because of its recent move yesterday is currently down 69% is Matic. Matic is currently sitting at 90 cents and is down about 69% from its all time high. However, yesterday it was down 70%, so we're going to still include it in this video. Matic is a native token for the Polygon network, which is a well-structured, easy-to-use platform for Ethereum scaling and infrastructure development. Essentially, it is the biggest layer two project in the market. The closest layer two project behind it is about $7 billion behind. If we were to move up from the current price to its previous all-time high, that's a 222% return. I know this might not sound like a lot in crypto, but it's one of the safer bets in the market. The next project we're looking at is Cosmos Atom, currently at $10.86 and down about 75% from its previous all-time highs. In a nutshell, Cosmos describes itself as a project that solves some of the hardest problems facing the blockchain industry. It is the eighth biggest layer one project by market cap, and a move back to its all-time highs would be a 312% profit. The final one we're taking a look at here is Litecoin. Litecoin, one of the OG in the market is currently at $92, down about 78% from previous all-time highs. Litecoin was designed to provide fast, secure, and low-cost payments with the use of blockchain technology. It was created by Charlie Lee back in 2011, a former Google employee who intended Litecoin to be the light version of Bitcoin. A move back up to its previous all-time highs would be a return of 348%. Litecoin also has a halving every four years, and the next one is coming up in 65 days. I did a full video breakdown on exactly what to expect with the Litecoin halving and what it could mean for its price. Next, let's take a look at projects down over 80% from previous all-time highs. If you haven't done so yet, don't forget to subscribe and smash that like button. So next on the list is XRP, who's currently down over 85% from previous all-time highs. Now you'll notice here that the last time it hit its all-time high was five years ago. That's due to the ongoing case it still has against the SEC. XRP was launched in 2020 12 as a faster, more energy efficient alternative to the Bitcoin blockchain. If XRP goes back to its all time highs of $3.40, that would be a return of 578% from current prices. Next, we have Arbitrum, which is down over 85% from its previous all-time high. Now, this one's a little bit different because it was launched just two months ago. Arbitrum is an Ethereum layer two scaling solution similar to Polygon. Although this is a newer project, I do think there is opportunity here. And I wouldn't be surprised to see it break into the top 20, top 15 crypto projects by market cap by the next bull run. It is already the second biggest layer two coin by market Cap. Our return to previous highs will be a return of 610%. Next is Chainlink, currently sitting at $6.57 with an all-time high of $52.70. So it is currently down 87% from previous all-time highs. Founded in 2017, Chainlink is a blockchain abstraction layer that enables universally connected smart contracts. A move back up to its previous all-time highs will be a return of 702%. And the last one on the list of projects down over 
80% is Cardano, currently down 87%, sitting at 38 cents, with an all-time high of $3.09. Cardano was founded by Charles Hawkinson, who was one of the co-founders of the Ethereum network. A move back to previous all-time highs would be a return of 721%. And finally, let's take a look at the projects that are down over 90% from their previous all-time highs. The first project we have here is Avalanche, currently down 90% from its previous all-time highs, which was $144. Currently, it's sitting at $14.46. Avalanche is a layer one blockchain that functions as a platform for decentralized applications and custom blockchain networks. You can see that Avalanche is the seventh biggest layer one project in the market, making this project one of the safer bets for the next bull run. A move back to previous all-time highs will be a return of 902%. Next, we have Polkadot, also down 90%, currently sitting at $5.44 with an all-time high of $54.98. Polkadot was designed to provide a foundation for a decentralized internet of blockchains, also known as Web3. Similar to Cardano, one of the founders of Polkadot is Dr. Gavin Wood, who was an Ethereum co-founder. He is also the creator of the smart contract coding language Solidity, and he's credited with coining the term Web3. This project ranks high on my long-term list, and a move back to previous all-time highs will be a return of 910%. This next one might trigger you, but it is Solana, currently down over 91% from previous all-time highs, sitting at $20.98 with an all-time high of $259.96. Solana is a highly functional open source project that banks on blockchain technology's permissionless nature to provide DeFi solutions. Solana had a massive, massive drop due to its connection with FTX and Sam Bankman-Fried. Due to this, I think it's created a huge, huge opportunity for investors like us. Network activity continues to grow and more and more developers are using Solana. A move back to its all-time highs will be a return of 1,139%. So although there might be some risk, it's definitely worth the reward. Some other notables that are down over 90% from their all-time highs are Doge, the crypto of Elon Musk and the people, down over 90%. Phantom, also down over 90%. HBAR, VeChain, down over 92%. The Graph, down over 95%. A return to previous all-time highs would be a 20x. Algorand, also down over 95%. A move back to all-time highs would be a 22x. Gala, down over 96%. And a move back to its previous all-time highs would be a return of 26x. And Bitcoin Cash, down almost 97%. A move back to previous all-time highs would be a return of 32x. However, it's important to know that it set its all-time high in the 2017 bull run, five years ago. Last bull run's high was $1,642. So are all these projects going back to their all-time highs? Probably not. This especially becomes true the further away you move from the top 25 or so crypto projects. But we don't need all of them to do so. If we equally invest in each, and let's say that 25 of these projects go negative or to zero, while the rest do hit the previous highs, we will still make a profit. You can check out this in-depth breakdown that I did in my previous video, where I went back to the previous bear market and tracked how the top 100 crypto projects performed. Here's a spoiler, only 23% of the top 100 projects went negative during the following bull run. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos just like this.